Guys, welcome back. This is Austin Linney with your Friday rant. Uh, I had a thought this morning. You know, we read uh, so many business books. We read so many. Uh, we listen to so many business podcasts, so many real estate podcasts. And one of the things that gets left behind is just human skills, like people skills. They'll call them soft skills, whatever you want to call them. But uh, proper communication, um, how to open the door for somebody, um, how to be happy. These are the things that aren't glamorized because the quantifiable metric of seeing those skills is very hard, right? Uh, a business skill, a real estate skill, uh, a money get skill, um, you can see that as it grows. But being somebody that's likable, being somebody that people want to do business with, being a good person is the actual superpower when it comes to life and business. But nobody talks about that. They, they've, they've stripped the nuance out of business and they've created a system where you got to opt, over-optimize your schedule, your morning routine, and nobody. So, so everybody's on this hustle thing. So when you first meet somebody, you pitch them right there with your idea instead of uh, gaining a relationship. There are people in my life that um, will become friends and we might do business together, but that might be five years from now. We might be in a place five years from now. And so I'm planting the seeds. Uh, I'm getting to know them and their family. There are people that are short term, uh, people where you, you become friends real quick. And, and that's more of a friendship. Um, but you know, networking is a is, is not the way you look at it. You're you're always so planting seeds to grow fruit later, and we don't talk about that at all. We talk about well, what's your revenue number? You know, how many units do you have? And and we over well, you got to do this type of marketing and this type of sales and this you got to use this CRM, and nobody talks about like, hey, what if you're just a more likable person? What if you're somebody that remembers people's names or certain situations about them or, or gives them a gift? Like, like, where did all this get lost in translation? People do business with people they like. And yet we're overemphasizing sales metrics, uh, real estate metrics. Uh, I've read this many books. Like, how to win friends and influence pe people is the roadmap to life. And yet we don't focus on it at all. Nobody talks about it because we've over-optimized life now. We've, we've gone off the deep end with being efficient with our time. And we're Nazis with everything. And we're, we're you can't do this. You can't do that. You, you know, I, but like, hey, like, hey, just, hey, how are you doing? What's going on? Are you okay? Oh, you like that team too? I love that team too. Right. We we've actually what we've gotten is people don't value small talk at all. Small talk is the way that people find to see if they have anything in common. It's the appetizer to the main event. But yet we've gone right past the appetizers and now we want to date you within meeting you in 5.2 seconds in business. There are a lot of people that it takes a year to five years to gain their trust when you're dealing with higher levels of business. And so maybe put down the business book and assess your person skills, your people skills, and see where you are lacking, enhance those, and watch the whole world open up for you. Hope I got some value from this, and we'll see you next time. Guys, let me take a minute to tell you about my buddies over at Lead Hub, Ben and Aaron, the best humans I know. Not only are they amazing at marketing for trade companies, but Ben started his HVAC company in his garage, sold it for multi-million dollars. So when this guy talks, I listen. When we took over Deets Mechanical, we had 22 reviews in 22 years. In seven short months, we went from 22 reviews to 107. We went from a 4.2 to a 4.7. We tripled our Facebook presence and we tripled our calls. If you're an HVAC, plumbing, electric, landscaping company, and you're looking for a no BS approach, to marketing, you're looking for people who have done it before, you got to go to leadhub.net 